In this video, let us see a solution for business rules in Power Apps were not applying to other users. Let's quickly jump into our problem. Currently, I am having a form which is intaking these values. And my country is having an active business rule. And let us click on the business rule and enter into that. And based on my selection in my country, you can see if I'm Checking my country as India, which is a drop down, and the city should be auto populated as Mumbai. And in case if I'm selecting New York, it should be Amsterdam. And if I'm selecting New Jersey, it should be Jersey City. Let us see that in practical. Currently, I opened the modern driven application, which I'm having. And let us select a country over here. And if I'm selecting my country as India, and you can see the city name is a read only column, and that is getting auto populated and if I'm selecting New Jersey, it is Jersey City. Let us just insert this row. And let's go to other user in the incognito tab. I logged in as a Tony Stark, which is a pretty famous name and I'm entering the details. If I'm selecting any of the country here, you can see our business rule is not getting applied. And let us quickly go to the solution part. Now let us first see what exactly the roles of the current logged in users. Go to the Power Apps Admin Center, click on Settings and click on Users, and let us see the permissions of the current user. Currently, we are logged in as a user who is having the business rules working. And you can see currently the role is System Administrator. And let's come to the role of the Tony Stark. Here we have a custom role created on the top of the basic user. And let us see what exactly this role contains. And here we can see this is our role. And let's click on that role. And let's click on edit. And click on custom entities. And this will display all the tables in which you are having in your dataverse. Now let us search for our table, which is Toy Store. And here we can see this is our table and currently the read permissions, the write permissions and the delete were based on that particular user. And if you can see when we logged in as Tony Stark and if you click on back, you can see there is no data getting displayed, even though we have three records which are inserted by me. This indicates that row level security is been applied. And let us see what exactly causing the issue for business rules are not getting applied. For that, you need to click on customization and search for process. Currently, you can see over the read privilege, we can only see he is able to read the process which he created. So he actually need to follow the process for entire organization. So as a user, we are going to follow the process which is given for entire organization. For that, you just need to change this rule to entire organization. And if you want to know what exactly the color indicates, at the bottom you can see there is a legend which exactly tells about it. And this color indicates user, half indicates business unit, and three fourths of the green indicates jail business unit, and full green indicates entire organization. We just need to ensure currently the read permission is for entire organization. And click on save. Now let us go back to the Tony tab. Even though we applied the process to organization level, even if you click on new, currently this will not be applied. You can see we are clicking on the country, but we are not seeing any change over here. And the reason is the browser is storing its caches. For that, we just need to clear the caches of the browser and we need to log in as Tony Stark again. As this is an incognito, let us just close this and open this tab again. And let us log in with our account details. And we are now logged in back to the Tony Stark account. And let us click on new. And now let us see by selecting a country over here. And now you can see whenever we are selecting the country, you can see our business role is getting affected. And you can see there is a change in the city name. All we need to do is we just need to ensure that process column is set to organization level for the read permission. 